you're gonna grab a Kali stick and you have to grab a tom. And we're gonna go ahead and go through some stick disarms. We're gonna take a look at the vine disarm and the ejection disarm. Let's go ahead and uh, get right on into it. If you do not have a stick to train these disarms with, you want a beautiful rattan stick just like this and just like his, well, you're in luck. Head over to KaliCenter.com, go order yourself a pair just like this. We'll send you a complimentary stick bag as well. And then, you can do these training, you can do these drills. All right, let's go ahead and uh, get it going right here. Let's take a look at the vine disarms first because these are some really cool drills. I'm gonna flip it around so that way you can see it better. Off the angle one, let's take a look at the vine disarm first because this one's, this one's really cool. So as he strikes the angle one, I'm gonna come in with that deflection and I'm gonna check his hand just like this. The weapon's gonna come underneath. Before you do any kind of disarm, you wanna make sure that you hit your opponent so that way they don't uh, you know, want to grab your weapon, right? You already smash him in the knee, smash, broke the ribs, and then you're going to smash him up, and you're going to place it just like this. You're going to transfer, so there's a little bit of a web, a little bit of a, of a lever right here. I'm going to go on his form, keep the thrust threatened on him, and then you can pry it out. Now you have his stick, now you get to beat him up with two sticks, and you win. So from here, let's take a look at that again, nice and slow, and a little bit closer, Mr. Cameraman. So as it comes out, boom, I need you to get this. You gotta get this right here. You gotta have the hand in control of that. Strike him, break his knee, break his ribs, put it, you could thrust him in the face, and then pry it out. And then finish him up, or you're ready to fight multiple opponents. Let's take a look at the vine disarm on the backhand, on the angle too, because it's a little bit different, but still pretty cool. So as he comes in on that number two, boom, same exact idea. We have to get that deflection and get the hand at the same time. Okay, from here, we're gonna thrust him just like this. Give him a thrust. I'm being nice for training. In reality, you can pop him right in the face. Right, and then I'm gonna dive this underneath and we're gonna create the lever a different way, just like that. And then, whoop, we're gonna take it out. And if you know any of the Silawali, you got it. If you don't know the Silawali, then go over to the Kali Center channel and go search Kali Center double sticks. So when you have the double sticks, now you know what to do with them. You know how to beat up Tom. So he comes out with the angle two again. Boom, there's the deflection. You could smash his hand real quick if you need to. He'd probably lose that. Um, so then, you know, you don't get a chance to do that cool disarm. So you could thrust him, keep the stick in his hand so you got the cool disarm, and then you got it. Boom. And then you give it back to him by hitting him with it. That's the vine disarm. Let's take a look at the ejection. So from here, boom. We're gonna come in just like that. But instead of going underneath, we're gonna continue to pass the weapon through just like this. And then I'm gonna put my weapon here. In reality, you'd be smashing his hand with the puño, but I'm gonna be nice to Tom because I smashed him enough already in this video. And I am gonna smash him a little bit more. I'm gonna use my form right here to eject the weapon. See how his weapon's gonna fly right in his face as I hit him at the same time. That's the ejection off of the number one. Let's take another look at that one more time. Come in a little bit closer, a little bit closer. Nope, off of the number one. All the smashing, it's just still so from here. My brain. <laughs> Boom, we're right here. <laughs> this time, remember, we're not going, if we go under, that's gonna bring us into the vine disarm. So we're gonna continue to drive this all the way out like that. You want to get this in line with like your right side of your body. And I'm going to place it, eject it, and smash. If you are as good as me, you're going to balance his weapon just like that. <laughs> and then you can smash him out. All right, so all you trolls that think you can't do that, I just did. All right, so from here, let's take a look at the ejection on the backhand side. So as it comes out, crack right there. Now you're just going to grab that thumb. You're going to peel that thumb, place it. And as you shoot this back at him, boom, you smash him right in the face. That makes the disarm pretty functional. So again, he comes out, boom, right there. We place it. You can also use the weapon here as leverage as well, or you can use your form right here. And then there's the ejection. Okay, from there, you go back to the outside, and then you can follow him up. Right. Start slow with all of these, take your time. This is just a drill. This is not necessarily how you're gonna apply them in a real fight. We're not fighting right now. 
So work the drill, the skill is in the drills. Then it's up to you to have ingenuity to figure out how to actually apply it. Or come and train with us and we'll just teach you and then you don't have to figure it out. So if you want to advance your training with us here at Kali Center, two things I need you to do for me. Number one, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. That's your entry. Hit the like button. Leave me a comment below. Which of the disarms do you think is more functional or practical, the vine or the ejection? And then head over to collicenter.com. Since you already ordered a pair of sticks, sign up to the online school. All right. All right, I have to get back to training because I have all these people waiting for me. Okay, go and pan over. All right, so uh, I'm out of here.